winding up for a long throw. And it's not long enough. Picks off at the near post comfortably. It's a better ball into the far post, and that could easily be the opening goal. Did it cross the line? The assistant on the near side, Scott Ledger, kept his flag down. Wayne Hennessy just managed to fall on it right on the line. Hadley had Doyle on his back. Hunt. Had a knockdown. Volley from O'Hara with his last favoured right. Wasn't well struck. Ball over the top, Roberts. Almost burst onto it and bundles his way through a couple of challenges. Finds Formica, driven a little wide. Touch from the goalkeeper, but that one has crossed the line. Blackburn take the lead. Mauro Formica with his first goal on his debut for the club. Signed in the January transfer window last season. Didn't play due to injury. Great work from Jason Roberts. Tremendous persistence. And he supplied the finish when possibly he didn't look favourite. Stearman. Jarvis in acres of space. Looks for Fletcher, and that's 1-1. He scored on opening day last season on debut. He's done it again this time around. And Wolves back on level terms very, very quickly indeed. But you've got to wonder, where were the defenders? That's poor defending. Let's put this ball in here. The defence is too too deep for one thing. Nobody's trapped the runner. Ward. Ward's just guilty of slowing that attack up with a couple of misplaced passes. Hunt. Great control and gets the shot away. And having worked the opening for himself, probably should have done a bit better than that. Fletcher finds Jarvis. Salgado stretching, seemed to play the ball, but the referee has pointed to the penalty spot. Salgado and his captain, Paul Robinson, can't quite believe it. Well, he likes a tackle, doesn't he? Salgado, massively, massively experienced player. Save. Danger not clear though. And it finds the back of the net anyway through Ward. And that is a tremendous left footed strike from the Wolves man. Just moments beforehand, they've been in despair, those fans, as they saw the penalty saved. And then in absolute rapture. Oh, what a start to the second half. Should be a chance now, and just turned round the post by Jason Roberts and Zonzi. Well, I'm sorry, I, mean, I said there'd be more chances. <laughs> Left footed shot wasn't too far away. <laughs> Roberts was the target. Just a layoff was a good one. Good Willie! First chance, it's not a bad effort, is it? Should be Hennessy's ball. Didn't get Ooh, the first time. About. Just about. His look less than convincing. We're a little bit stretched on numbers, to be honest, today, and we had to play uh, Stephen Zons as a centre back because we're missing Gil Give, Chris Samba, and Ryan Nelson. So that was tough because we then lose the impact that Stephen's been giving us all pre season in the middle of the pitch. Um, so we're disappointed. I thought the game was very open to start with, and uh, they, they got a well taken goal. I thought ours was a terrific equaliser. And you're right, I thought once we equalise, we control the game, to be honest. It's never fun when you start well and then you lose in the, in the end. Well, uh, let's take a look at the possession between Blackburn and Wolves. Blackburn Rovers enjoyed most of the possession, 53% to 47% from Wolves, but in the end, Wolves still prevail. Uh, let's take a look at the shots on target, 17 from Blackburn Rovers to Wolves, 15. And uh, once again, let's take a look at the yellow cards, 4 to Wolves, 2. But the corners, 
What a waste. 12 from Blackbird Rovers, none of which actually worked out.